Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today's the 24th of February, 2023. We're going to talk about uh, Dogecoin today and actually try to get an understanding as to whether or not smart money is selling this currency because price hasn't gone up. Now, you guys can tell zooming in on the price chart that I've been looking for Dogecoin to go lower anyway. So I'm not really antsy to just try to figure out why is not Dogecoin moving higher. Take a look at the markets. So I did a video in Dogecoin. My latest one was on the 14th of February. And you guys can see that my anticipation is for price to go lower. Now, obviously, that hasn't happened just yet. But we do have more information that we didn't have on the 14th of February that we have now that kind of tells us that we're still on the same track. Check this out. First thing, you guys can tell that the market in Dogecoin decided to break the trend, right? That's the first thing. When market breaks trend, it tells you that the dynamics, that the emotions of the market participants has changed. So back here in the beginning of the year, the market was bullish. Cool. But then here on the 9th of February, the market became bearish. And then not only do we get that, another thing that occurred into the market in Dogecoin was the fact that even when we saw price move higher, right? We can see where price got rejected. Isn't that amazing? The market in Dogecoin got rejected right here as it attempted to trade back above our trend line. That's not by coincidence. We need to take the information that we get and utilize it. The market is telling us something and it's telling us that it's still weak. We've seen numerous days following this rejection on our trend line, the 17th and then the 18th of February, that even the buyers could not move price above our trend line. We got to take note of these things and utilize it for our benefits and no one else's. So, yes, the current environment into the market in Dogecoin, considering what happened on this day, February the 16th, is still letting you know that the market is still a little bit weaker than it is given the strength. So in actuality, that is the reason why smart money is selling, because they're looking at the same type of information that we have access to now. And they pay attention to the information. They don't go in hoping and wishing if the market is going against what you're trying to do. You need to act quickly. And just don't sit there twiddling your thumbs and trying to hope and wish that the market will go your direction. The market is giving us answers every day. It's up to you to act on it, though. So let's look at this on the two day chart real quick until the market in Dogecoin. You guys can see. I'm not giving you all information that you guys don't already have. The important part is how you interpret that information. OK, so looking at this on the two day chart, look at all of these two day price bars to where price closes lower than the previous two days. Right. Look at this four two day price bars. The market in Dogecoin is closing lower. That tells you that there's more sellers. In the market and that the demand of the buyers is not coming through. So the market in Dogecoin is still weak. Now, the problem comes in in determining how weak is the market then? Is it extremely weak to where we can see price run down to five and a half cents? Or is it just weak enough to where price is gonna come down to eight cents? That's the problem. That no amount of information, no algorithm, no fortune teller can tell you how low price is going to go. But the environment from the two day chart is giving us weakness. Take a look at the market at Dogecoin on the three day. Look at this last completed three day price bar. That is in combination with what occurred here on this three day price bar to where we saw an increase in volume and the market closing off the highs. The market is still weak in Dogecoin. day chart you get a better image of looking at price breaking trend here on that five day price bar so if anything what I'm looking at right now in the market in Dogecoin is simply consolidation trading range that's it traded from left to right the trend is broken to the upside we may start a small minor trend to the downside but only within the trading range okay now the trade range could be two things. It could either be here 
like I said, around eight cents as support with resistance at 10 cents. That could be a trading channel. Or the market coming all the way down here to like seven cents, seven and a half cents as support. That is where I have my ultimate TP price at already. Down there around seven cents. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create this support area and the market in Dogecoin as a reference point. Now I'm done. I'm not going to change my price prediction, but I just wanted to show you how smart money reacts to information that it didn't have before, that it now has, and what they would do with it. They won't change their idea, their original intentions if they're if they still see the market weak, which I, I still do. So I'm just going to simply extend out this line, give the market a couple more days to play this out. But so far with this trend line breaking in the market in Dogecoin tells us exactly what's going on. OK, so that is it. Everyone, give me your thoughts. Uh, let me know what do you guys think the price is headed. If you think it is going down, like just go ahead and get everyone your price targets and we'll see if you're right or wrong. There's no there's actually no right or wrong about it. We're just simply forecasting and trying to predict how low we think price is going to go or where price is even going to go because people try to tell you that you can't do it. And all of my videos here on this platform is specifically doing that, predicting prices and where it's going to go. So I want to know what you guys think. Now, if you guys want to get my targets, I recommend that you guys go to the Dogecoin playlist on my channel. Look at the last video and you guys will get it there. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.